Welcome back to another episode of Will, Will Vlog, Vlog for food. food. I'm Josh. I'm Tim, and, and this is the show where we take you anywhere and everywhere to find the greatest places to eat. Where are we today, Josh? We are at Medici. Medici, the Neapolitan Pizza Company. That's what it says, sorry. Neapolitan Pizza Company. Let's check that out. Ah, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Here's how it works. You walk in and you grab a menu from the front table here and you find any seat you'd like. After sitting down and looking over the menu, you walk up to the front counter and you order right there. And then they bring the food out to you guys. Hey Tim. What? Can you grab me three forks? Why do you... Yes. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Okay, we I got, got my menu. fork and my knife. You've got your fork, your fork, your fork, your fork and your knife. And we're all set. This is some incredible garlic bread. Yeah, right? it looks awesome. I'm gonna go from, yeah, let's get the ends, man. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that's delicious. Oh, wow. This is nice and crispy and very oily. I love how oily it is. All of the flavors are like subtle, but all of them combine just like they hit you. I'm getting thirsty. So what do we got going on here? This is an Italian soda, right? Italian cream soda. Italian cream soda. Blood orange. It's got like whipped cream on it, dude. Yeah. I'm going to try this. Here we go. Right. I'm going to have more bread. It's incredible. Oh, that looks... Yeah, don't drink it all. I'm sorry, I, I, took, drink, I took like man. three sips and I was like, wait, that's you. I got the basil limeade. Okay. I um, love these so much. Oh, that is so refreshing. This is like hot day, sun's bearing down, you're sitting in the shade, you drink some of this. See what I mean? Yeah. Hold on. All right, go ahead. I mean, that, that is the burrata with melon and ham. Take a little slice of this cheese. Okay, so I gotta get this cheese. The cheese on it. Do we wanna get the... Oh, look at how creamy this is. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, oh, wow. it's mixed with cream. Okay. So that's why it spreads so and nicely. And then we put some of this prosciutto on it? I don't know, but we're gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> um. mm. That's delish. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, that works. Mm -hmm. That works. Keep that mess over there, bub. I really love this balsamic reduction on here. It's, I think it's my favorite flavor. It's kind of like a malt vinegar flavor, but it's thicker than malt vinegar. So it looks like what they're doing here now is putting the pizza in these ovens that are made in Italy. Is that right? Yes, sir. Made in Italy? That's so cool. These are 1,000 degree ovens that cook pizza in 90 seconds. Can you believe that? Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, okay. oh that's delish. My, oh, that looks beautiful. Yes. Still bubbling, still bubbling, man. This is the margarita pizza. So this is the classic Neapolitan style pizza. Immediately, this pizza crust. It's thin, sturdy, wood-fired, and still soft. So a lot of times on Neapolitan pizza, they'll take the cheese and they'll they'll put them on the pizza in clumps. Little so globules, that, actually. It's a little matzo ball, ma, 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 not matzo ball. <laughs> matzo balls. Mozzarella balls. Right, and then they'll just sort of melt in a spot. And so when you look at the pizza, it's gonna look like it's polka dotted with mozzarella cheese instead of pepperoni. Fun fact is uh, that Neapolitan style pizza is the inspiration to New York style pizza because uh, it was brought over, oh shoot, it was like early 20th century by the Italian immigrants and they made their pizzas, everyone loved them and then it spread like wildfire and now you've got New York style, you've got St. Louis style pizza. Okay, we gotta keep saving room here. We need, we need to try the next one. Man, I wish these were bottomless, they're so good. I know. Mm. 
This is the shrimp scampi. It has fresh mozzarella, shrimp, green bell peppers, red onions, garlic, oregano, and it is topped with baby arugula after it is done being baked. If there's one thing that I love on pizza, it's shrimp. Oh. <clears throat> so one thing to note with this pizza is that it is a non-tomato based pizza. It has an olive oil pesto base. Uh, it leaves the, the crust soft mm -hmm. and, and moist. With the pesto base, it actually sort of sits and soaks in to the crust. So it even gives the crust a different flavor. And a different texture. And the shrimp accent some of that sweetness in the pesto. These flavors work really, really well together. It's like in Mission Impossible when you see all the different characters working together. Do you guys fold your pizza in half? Because I, I do that. I always fold my pizza in half. And there's three main reasons why. Reason number one, it makes it more portable. You can walk around with it and not lose anything. Oh. And that's the second reason, is because it's a lot harder to lose things on your pizza when you have it folded. When it's not folded, look at this. <laughs> no, I'm not Stuff losing flying anything. everywhere. <laughs> You're right, Josh. Reason number three, it looks cool. Reason number four, every time you fold the pizza... You had three reasons. Well, there's another one. Reason number four. Every time you fold a pizza, it's You're almost, lying to me now? Every time you fold a pizza... I don't like it when you lie to me. Every time you fold a pizza, it's like Dude, eating... If you, a, if you oh say gosh. three... Reason number four, every time you fold... Reason number four is every time you fold your pizza, it's almost like you're eating a calzone. Which reminds me, we have dessert... I saw that. Which reminds me, we have dessert coming up. Sorry. We've been hearing about this all day and night, and it's been recommended to us. What is this? This is our Nutella signature, Nutella calzone with fresh berries. Oh man. I mean, it's stuffed with Nutella, then it's baked in our own dough that we roll and press and, and ball every night. So it's fresh, less than 24 hours. Okay. And all the fresh berries are cut every morning fresh. Mm -hmm. And then it has our Nutella, Signature M for Medici on it, as well as some balsamic glaze. Well, so how long has this location been open then? This has been open since November of last year, so we're just at our one year point. Just reaching that one year, yeah, that's one exciting. Year, so it is exciting. Um, this looks incredible. Uh, how did, I don't even have a question about it, because it's just, it, man, it's so good. I'll put so, it this way, you eat this, you're not getting up. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it, I'll, okay. I'll take that, man. <laughs> All right. Gentlemen, enjoy, okay? Oh, we will. Thank you Thank so you. much. All right. Thank you too. This looks incredible. I, you don't get any of this. It's mine. I'm just going to leave now and take hey. it with me. <laughs> and you like, just eat your food, man? I want to eat this, and I can't eat this till you finish eating that. I'm eating a strawberry. Actually, I'm eating a blackberry. <laughs> Chocolate and fruit, man. That's so good. If only you could have some of this, man. This Nutella here with this. Strawberry and this blueberry. I'm trying to finish what's in my mouth, the man. Powdered sugar. Mmm. 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 Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is the really cool thing about this is they stuff it with fruit. Yeah. And this also is a, this is a calzone of strawberries people. and blackberries and blueberries. Yeah. Mmm. Oh man. The chocolate mellows out the sweet. Mm. Oh my gosh, dude. This is like sensory overload. Crispy on the outside, really soft and fruity, and tons of flavor on the inside. And on top of that, so much Nutella. Oh my gosh. Just glazed Oozing. over the entire thing. I feel like low key, our subconsciousnesses are fighting over who gets more. Dude, we devoured this. Well, if you're gonna stop there, I'm gonna scrape the plate. That is one of the most delightful desserts I think I've ever had. Oh yeah, this is to die for. I wouldn't die for this. I would. I would I would allow myself to be seriously maimed, maybe. This is some of the best Neapolitan I've had, at least in the Kansas City area. I can agree with you on that. That was Medici Neapolitan so style pizza. So good. If you like oh. Neapolitan pizza, you are missing out if you haven't been here yet. You have to come and check it out. Absolutely. That does it for this episode. 
Remember, we are on Facebook and YouTube. Make sure you like our page on Facebook and subscribe to us on YouTube. Remember to hit the bell notification to always get updates whenever we come out with a new video. We are also on Twitter and Instagram. We always have random posts and stories on there. In addition to those two places, we do have a Patreon page. That is a good way for you guys to receive back what you give to us. It lets us keep doing what we're doing so you can keep doing what you're doing. So thanks guys so much for watching and until next time, chill out and feast.